What's good, everybody? It's your boy Seth with another fire serial review. I'm back. It's been a little bit of a hiatus, but today we're back with new family size. Because I'm a family Pop Tart cereal. Why is it every time exclusive cereal comes out, they push this family size bullshit on you? I don't understand. Also, Pop Tarts taking over the breakfast game here. Not only do they have the pastries filled with fake jam jelly shit, now we have cereal filled with fake jam jelly shit. So I'm going to be trying the frosted strawberry edition. There is also the maple cinnamon, but we don't want to be too healthy with pop tarts. And plus, this is what I ate all the time as a kid, so this is as unbiased as I can get. If I don't enjoy this, I won't enjoy it. Step number one. As you all may or may not know, I kind of went to school for design. So this is, or something, or whatever. So this is something that makes sense to me. I don't know what it is with breakfast cereals. Making their boxes very blue and plain, but here we go. Backside. What the fuck is this? I don't see a relation here. It, whatever. It's nice and colorful, bright, whatever. Box. Well, that's what they look like. They look like frosted mini wheats, but I'm sure they're filled with bullshit Pop Tart jam. And what better time to be doing this review than at 10.06 at night? Let's get into the taste test and the actual review of this product. Alright, so let's get into this taste test. Will Pop-Tarts remain king of the breakfast scene and drop the hottest mixtape of 2019? Or will it simply just go to my love handles and I will hate everything about my life like I do with most of these kind of novelty cereals? So right away, just in the bowl, really strong, sugary, strawberry scent. As you all know, I do a dry taste first. Yum, yum. Okay, it kind of tastes like how I thought it would, kind of tastes like Crave cereal, where it's like this like little biscuit and it's filled with shit, but it's like way sweeter on the outside and it's filled with, like I thought, that generic jam shit. Honestly kind of pleasantly surprised, which I knew I was going to hate myself for. Sorry, the camera cut off, but like I said, as I thought, I knew I was going to hate myself for this. Because this cereal, I'm sure I will actually kind of enjoy, which is fucking disgusting. Anyways, let's do a milk test. As always, everybody always gets mad at me, because I add a lot of milk to my cereal. But if milk, or if, what the fuck ever, it's 10 o'clock at night, shut up, it's been a long day. If cereal can't withstand milk, what's the point of cereal, am I right? Ladies. Okay, so we're going to get a nice... Milk a butt of cereal. Look at that. Looks just like Pop Tarts. Huh. That is odd. You just get basically the crunch at first. I was like, where's, where's the jam that's packed into these? And it hits you at the very end. That is so. I need a second opinion on this. Hold on. The texture of this jelly shit in the middle, it's a little weird. It's like kind of chewy. You got like this weird texture. I don't know. It's honestly not horrible though. I'm a little mad at myself. It's honestly like, it's not something I go out and get like regularly but you know it's pretty decent i give it like a seven if you're kind of on the fence go on and at least try it once it's better than some of the dog shit cereals i reviewed Devonte. but you know not bad pop tart cereal go get some 